Xiao Ho Ba will be heading for Shu. You don't wish us to give chase? No. <coughs> the Xia Ho clan's achievements are well known. Killing him will bring unnecessary trouble. He sides with his father's killers ah, to save his own hide. <laughs> ah. I couldn't do it. Father, the enemy has emerged from the castle and has formed defensive ranks. Why would they come out? It is the height of Sure, you must act as a decoy and attack from the south. Zhao, once the enemy reacts to Shur's attack, you must strike from the rear. I swore to my lord that I would never give up until we had built a land of benevolence. It's all right. It's okay. Did you see that? That tenacity? Our father has left us with a few issues left to solve. Ah... <sighs> Why must people cling to their outdated ideals so stubbornly? Come to think of it, the last few years have been spent consolidating our rule. What's more, Father has moved with an uncharacteristic sense of haste. He had us both fooled all along. <laughs> My son, you must lead in my place. Use it as you see fit. You are just leaving it all to me. Well, if I know you at all, you're excited by the prospect. I won't deny it. There is none more qualified than myself to lead way into the future. <laughs> Just make sure that you walk the right path. <laughs> this is all you have. Brother, I... Uh, sorry about that. Tell me, Zhao. What does it mean to you to hold high rank? What? Uh, well, actually, 
it means nothing, then discard it. That will be the punishment for your failure. I will punish the Suma and let Yuga Dawn off scot free. This integrity will prove invaluable in building my machine. Brother, you... Father told me to use power as I see fit. I intend to aim for the top. Rumblings of discontent afoot. You should not walk alone. But you won't bother to stop me. What? I... <laughs> if they want to attack me, so be it. Right now, I am the only man fit to rule this land. But if there is one who can defeat me, I will gladly. This is all you have. land is mine to unite. You serpent! You will be done! <laughs> 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 Shochu and castle is ours! Leave the rest to me! Come, if you have what it takes to kill me. Even with supreme power, there are some things that cannot be controlled. The enemy's ingrained loyalty, you mean? That... and fate. My lord! Brother. You fool! I thought I told you to defend Lord Young. So, Juga Leong, you have fallen. Father, why do you sound so sad? We have lost perhaps the only man who is truly worthy of being pitted against my intellect. 
The battlefield shall now be such a boring place. What's wrong with that? Boring is easy. Sounds good to me. Begin the pursuit. Zhao, keep your focus. I know, I know. Hands down. All right, all right. <laughs> My lord. You must be upset at the loss of your rival. I wouldn't want you to lose your focus, either. Shall I go with you? Y yes Juga Leon, I shall honor your memory, at least by utterly destroying Shu. No matter. Now that you are gone, Juga Leong, I am free to advance as I please. Sure, Zhao, what is the problem with the land at war? Order is disturbed. Peace is shattered. Chaos <sighs> fostered and discord engendered. And it really is a pain in the neck. <sighs> Don't you think? Imbeciles are allowed to run free. That is the root of the problem. Those with talent are the ones who move history. That's the way it should be. Yet, those with no talent continue to stake their claim. It is an insult to the natural order of the land. Do you see, my sons? We must therefore hone our talents and mold this land into its rightful form. use our talents to restore way to greatness. <sighs> Aren't we getting a little carried away? I mean, it's how Shuang has to go, sure, but... Zhao, these things have to be thorough. In order for these fools to understand their place. Give it up. If you show them mercy, then you'll really have a mess on your hands. Come! We shall destroy these fools and return Wei to its true glory. <clears throat> Thanks to you all. We have defeated Cao Shuang. This has proven to me that your intellect and bravery will be more than enough to lead way in the future. And so I... <coughs> and so now, I wish to announce... My withdrawal from public life. My son, sure, shall take over for me. Father. Why would you choose to do this? We need you now. You have grown physically, but not mentally, it would seem. You're grown men, both of you. Don't you think it's time that you stood on your own two feet? Uh, well... Listen to me. Sure. Zhao. You have talent. 
but you must strive for more. Be not happy with now, but think of tomorrow. Only with focus will you be able to- My lord. <clears throat> if you continue to baby them, they will never become men. I knew it would happen, but I did not think it would be so soon. What are you going to do, Zhao? What do you mean? You know I'll always be there to support you. Okay. Curse Wei! Curse all of you! This insult shall be avenged! Upon my name as a Jugan! <laughs> you are unworthy to speak that name! Jugadan, what specter are you looking at? What? What does blood mean? What do names mean? These things cannot hone your talent. A warrior lives by nothing but his own skills. The same goes for me. Those obsessed by their birth end up like that man. Hmm. Come, we're leaving. The son far outclasses the father. We will give pursuit! Wait. Leave Win Yang be for now. Tighten the noose around Wen Chi. Let us choke the life from this fool. My lord! Give it up. Do you really think I have the time to waste on the likes of you? The arrogance! The tyranny of the Suma ends here! <laughs> tyranny? I see. So that's how you see it. Nonetheless. That is the path I must take, to test the will of the heavens. Yeah! When young, <clears throat> you saved me. I am grateful to all of you. Our triumphant destiny has been preserved by your actions. Brother, you're injured. I am fine. <laughs> we have not finished yet. By our own hands, this land shall be righted. Zhao. Huh? Everyone. Well done. <gasps> we shall reform way under our ideals and seize control of the land itself. However, my own destiny. <laughs> Brother! Zhao, it now falls to you. Stop it! Don't say that! Jack 
Zhong. Leave it to me. Until the end, I did only that which needed to be done. Zhao. You too. This can't be happening. Brother. Brother! Oh. Uh, my lord, how is your wound? Calm yourself. It is little more than a scratch. Brother, what's that? This wound symbolizes my weakness. It can't be undone, nor can it be forgotten. But it is over. This mask is my vow to move on. <laughs> That's funny, Zhao? No. It suits you. You really are a strong man. Destiny is with me. Wei has been put in order. Now we shall conquer Wu and Shu, and put an end to this war perpetuated by imbeciles. Look, my lord. You made the right decision. I did. Good. Sure. Zhao. The two of you are my pride and joy. Come, my talented comrades. We will overcome our enemies and claim this land. I bring news. Master Suma Zhao has successfully taken Jianye. Hmm. Good. The land is almost ours. It's amazing. You're incredible, my lord. <laughs> What's happening? What's going on? <sighs> Shu forces have infiltrated the castle. Panic is spreading. They are resisting to the last. They have no hope, yet they struggle onward. If they stand against us, we must fight them. I am almost there. My destiny. Nothing can stand in our way. Comrades, we fight! Brother! Zhao, get everyone together. We are leaving at once. Uh, what? But you only just got here. No matter. Time is short. Why are you in such a hurry? Uh, don't tell me. Huh. You may look vacant, but you're smarter than most. Yes. The life that you have made long is almost at its end. But I will claim my destiny. Zhao, lend me your strength. Brother. Very well. All that I have is at your command. The land will soon be united as one underway. An age ruled by those with talent. This order will be created by me and by all of you here. We shall pioneer this new age, support it, and become its forefathers. 
A new land raised by our hand. Father, mother, my apologies for inconveniencing you so. Sure. Should you not first be grateful that we are alive? Ah, well, I had no doubt that you could handle Zhong Hui. Hm. So tell me, son, how do you intend to punish them? The Emperor, no, the former Emperor, has abdicated. From now, Cao Huan will be Emperor of Wei. Zhang Hui and those who sided with him have had their lands docked. Oh? But their lives not taken? I would have put them all to the sword, and their families as well. They no longer have the strength to resist us. If they are alive, we can use them. I see. A decision that suits the times. A wise course of action indeed, son. No. I learned everything I know from observing your genius. <laughs> Cut me down! Even if I die, I shall return as a spectre to fight you! Let me question your conviction, then. Why do you fight with such determination? Why do you think? To carry out the will of my fallen master and create a land of benevolence! Imbecile! That fool, Juga Leong, he failed to teach you the most important thing. While his intent was sound... Does the fight to realize a land of benevolence end with the land and its people worn down to nothing? If you truly believe in benevolence, then you must start by putting an end to this futile fighting. I... I... Does this mean we're finished? Yes. My destiny has been realized. Brother! What was it you said to me? Uh... From now on, I'll take things more seriously? <sighs> so, my lord, just where are you planning on going on such an important day? You, Angie... How did you know? <sighs> because you never change. But you don't need me around, do you? Brother sure has a flair for the dramatic. I was really worried when he collapsed. But now he's all better. And the Emperor has even given him the throne. Whenever my brother needs me, I'll be there. The rest of the time, well, 
You know me. You did it, brother. Father! What is it? Uh, uh, it's been a while since I saw you do that. Uh, we're sorry to stop you like that. Hmm. It seems you did not inherit this particular trick of mine. So what is it? With both of you here, I assume you aren't just talking about the weather. We're here to tell you that the Imperial family has been moved to Yeh. Now those who seek to remove you will surely not find it so easy to get to them. <laughs> Father? No. I am just amazed at Lord Cao Cao's foresight. He was always a bit wary of this ability of mine. Lord Cao Cao, when I had secluded myself from the world, saw my talent and gave me a central role in Wei. He weighed the dangers of my ambition against my ability, and in the end, chose my ability. At the time, so long ago, I could never really make sense of that. I mean, it had never even crossed my mind to betray him. I would never have thought of that. Father. And yet, Look at what we are doing right now. Who holds true power in the palace now? I see what you mean. If you put it like that, I understand. Lord Salsa left behind an able successor in Lord P. His only miscalculation was that Lord P died so young. Hm. Listen to me, you two. You must raise many worthy successors, so that after I'm gone, the world is not left to a bunch of fools. Yes. Yes, Father. So then, our line has totally collapsed. Forgive me. Master Sima Shi. Our officers and troops fought well, but could not hold out. Well, it couldn't have been helped. The movement of their vanguard was quite extraordinary. What do you mean, couldn't have been helped? We have responsibility to our troops and to the people. Why would you say such a thing? Why? Zhao is right, Jugadun. Victory and defeat are a part of battle. Sometimes, it is best to accept defeat. I had thought, with Sun Chuan gone, they would be weakened. But their spirit and that advance were worthy of the old Sun Wu. Brother, shall we pull everyone back? It wouldn't be right to get them all killed for no real reason. Hmm. The responsibility is mine. By my command, have our forces fall back. I will give the order. If there's blame for losing this battle, then it shall fall on both of us. It appears my time has still not yet come. I really don't want to have to drag this out. If you're going to do it, do it already! <laughs> Brother! See my sheep! Fire! <laughs> Say that, brother. I'm sorry. Yeah. Don't give up on trying. Never give up on living. Because you still have a greater fate waiting for you. Yes. 
My brother. <sighs> brother, are you sure you're okay to be up? Don't worry about it. Oh. <laughs> I guess that was a dumb question. That looks pretty good on you. Hmm. Zhao. Listen. From here on, there is no going back. We can't rid ourselves of these foolish commoners by just scraping away those close to the Wei Emperor. This coming world is something that we must build ourselves. However, Zhao, the Emperor is the fate of the land. No matter how our heart breaks, no matter how many lives we forsake, sometimes things just won't go our way. Brother. Zhao, I need everything you have to give. Help me to create a world that is governed by the Sima clan. For that, brother, we will gladly aid you. Right, you two? I can't believe how dependable you look. So I guess these wounds that were sustained were not in vain. Let's go. Let us aim for the top. <laughs> <laughs> Brother! Damn, this is all because of that wound you took back in the battlefield. If father were here, he would call you a fool. There is no profit in regretting what is past. Now, I understand my fate completely. It was my fate to bridge the gap that grew between you and the Sima family line. Please don't say that, brother. That is way too much responsibility for me to bear. Zhao, these are Master Xi's final words. Engrave them on your soul. Jia Chong, how dare you! But he is correct. Zhao, my final act is to entrust you with everything. Draw together those with talent. Open a path to a new age, to the future of Zhao Wei. 